Hey, what is up, guys? It's TK Fishing here, and I'm doing a video of a review. This is my first review video on my rod and reel setup. So let's get into it. So we're gonna start out with my rod, custom made rod, mud hole. It is seven feet tall and has the diamond wrap. My dad actually made this rod for me. Very nice rod and. Yep, very nice rod. Here's actually a picture of the rod. Sorry I couldn't get a picture of the full rod, but like, it's the best picture I could get. So, yep, let's go on to the reel. The reel is the Pen Class 3000. It's a very nice reel right here. Um, has nine bearings, eight stainless steel ball bearings, and one anti-reverse bearing. Very nice reel right here. Um, it can hold 200 yards 8 pound mono, 165 yards of 10 pound mono, and 120 yards of 12 pound mono. And for braid, which I'm using right now, um, it can hold let's see, uh, 250 yards of 15 pound braid, um, 180 yards of 20 pound braid, and 130 yards of 30 pound braid. So that's a lot of line hold on, it can hold on to. So yeah. Very nice reel, goes for $220, and yep, it's really nice, and I'll actually leave the link to the description to um, the Pen Class 3000, and to Mudhole's website if you want to create a rod yourself, but my dad's actually going to be making me a bait casting rod next, and I'm going to be getting the Lose LFS Speed Spool, so that'll be a very nice setup that's coming up next. I'll probably make a review video on that too, but I'm just trying to get videos out here because I'm going to be going to North Carolina in the beach, so I won't be able to post for like 12 days or something like that, so sorry about that, and well actually I might be able to post, but anyways, yeah, this is my rod and reel setup, and Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget about the giveaway I'm doing if I hit 50 subscribers. So, yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye.